Hey, praise God this morning. Um, I hope everybody's having a blessed day today. Whenever you see this, I pray the Lord may bless you even more and pour out spiritual blessings on you in abundance that you may grow in the knowledge of the truth and his love for us. It's so amazing. It gets better and better. And I want to tell you that no matter what we go through, you know, there's sometimes there's th there's things we go through seasons we have to stand and we feel like we're standing alone. And sometimes many times, even Apostle Paul said, uh, I stood by myself. But the Lord God, he stood with me. I pray he holds it to none of their accounts. Sometimes we have to stand alone. People don't understand our walk with the Lord. And, you know, and, and, and people get frustrated because you don't walk the same way they walk. But in the Bible, it says, you know, we work out our salvation with fear and trembling. You know, even and, 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 and even when Paul, Pastor Paul didn't walk the way the rest of them walked, you know, you know what they told him? They finally said, let God, let your will be done because they didn't think he ought to go to Jerusalem and preach anymore. And he did anyways. And they said, Lord, let your will be done. Nevertheless, you know, so sometimes God has us on different paths. But, you know, either way, all in all, we work out our own salvation with fear and trembling, you know, and, and just try to obey the word of God and stay in the word and and trust the Lord and um, come together in fellowship. That's so wonderful. The fellowship. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So praise God. Anyways, um, I got I got a verse for us to help us. If you're going through something, I want to tell you if you've been through something for the name of Jesus, if you walk through some things because you're walking in the truth and the truth that God has given you through his word, then I want to tell you something right here. You just keep going right here in verse uh, 35, Hebrews chapter 10, verse 35. Cast not away, therefore, your confidence, which have great recompense of reward. For ye have need of patience, that after you have done the will of God, the will of God, ye might receive the promise. After you have done the will of God, ye might receive the promise. For yet a little while, he that shall come will come, and will not tarry. Now the just shall live by faith. But if any man draw back, my soul shall have no pleasure in him. But we are not of them who draw back, my brothers and sisters, unto perdition. We are not one of them that draw back unto perdition, but of them that believe to the saving of the soul. So we believe unto the saving of the soul. We know we must do God's will. And I want to tell you, hold fast to that confidence. If you're standing in the word and other people don't agree with you and you trust the Lord and you trust his truth that he's given you through his word, you keep going. You keep going. God's going to reveal everything to you. You need to know. Hold fast to that confidence because that's going to prepare you for the next things. So God bless you. And to the saving of the soul, we believe all the way to the end, brothers and sisters. Glory be to God. He's coming to get us. We got to be ready. I pray that you're ready. Hold fast to that first confidence.